Let's pack to go to North Carolina. I'm so excited. I am leaving on the 11th of February to go for my 13 weeks in Hendersonville, North Carolina, and I'm super freaking excited. Um, I probably don't need to start packing right now, but I've decided that maybe packing a little bit at a time will get me a little bit more ready and not as stressed when the time comes. Um, so we are going to just do little by little the little things that I need. Um, I know that there's some stuff that I'm going to use throughout the week, uh, but I can just pick it up out of the suitcase. So I've got two suitcases and then a bunch of packing cubes that I'm going to try to condense my stuff down into. I'm going to do my very best not to take as much crap as I took to Louisiana because I took so much stuff, like an insane amount of stuff that I didn't even use, wear, need. Um, so I'm going to be very minimal about the things that I take. Um, honestly, I didn't do much other than go to the gym, go to the grocery, vlog a little bit. Um, that's about it. So let's do this. All right, we are going to start packing the bathroom up. I've got a few different containers that I'm gonna be using. So this is the bag that I'm just gonna put all of my like big stuff in. And then in my closet, don't judge, it's a mess in here, but um, whoops. I'm going to start packing the things. This is like skincare stuff, this is makeup. Um, and then I'm probably gonna just pack my skincare in that, um, maybe, we'll see. But it's kinda where we're at right now. Um, there's a bunch of stuff in here that I probably don't need to take and I'm gonna condense and figure out what does need to be taken and what doesn't need to be taken um, because last time I took away too much stuff and that's not happening this time. We're not gonna do that. that I want to show you guys um, this jacket it was highly reviewed on TikTok, um, which I'll link it in my Amazon storefront because I'm obsessed with it it is super lightweight um, it's super silky and soft it's gonna go right over my scrub top I'm obsessed with this so it's in a light blue color I'm gonna wear that with my scrubs and then Sam's Club actually had this one which is a very similar lululemon dupe um, it has a hood on it it's really soft it's like ultra soft actually um, so I got that one to go with my scrubs as well um, so there's those two I got this compression top it's like a periwinkle color off of Amazon love it what else did I have I had something else back oh I forgot all of this stuff has to go gosh dog it we might have to go get the other suitcase I really didn't want to take that much stuff for real for real for real I did not <clears throat> but I think I'm gonna have to go get it. Gosh dang it, because, sorry, that was really loud. Because I need to fit those things in, which I think I can still fit them. This thing's not very full, honestly, so I don't think I'll have a problem fitting them in here. Those can go there. 
Don't need to take those. Supposedly it's supposed to get really cold, so I'm definitely taking my Lululemon um, pants, my sweatpants. Taking those for sure, those can fit right on top. And then this is one of my other favorite shirts to wear when I work out. So we'll stick that right under there. What's a couple more pounds? And then this is one of my favorite sleep shirts. So we'll stick that right there too. Perfect, that wasn't even an issue. Um, yep, not even a problem. <gasps> Which I don't even think I'm gonna have like a closet, so we'll see. Oh crap, maybe it is a problem. I'm gonna have to sit on it to zip it. All right, we got it, we're good. So now, my scrubs still haven't, I hate that you guys can't see me. My scrubs still haven't come in yet. Um, so, I'm waiting for those to come in. I'm not sure when that will happen, um, but whatever. Hopefully it's before Saturday. Um, got my jackets, which honestly, if I have all these jackets, I don't really need all the sweatshirts. I very rarely wear this one, but I was going to take it for Valentine's Day. Because I probably am going to work on Valentine's Day. So we may take this one. And if I take this one, I may not take this one. So we'll leave that one home. For now, anyway. We may switch it out later on. Whoops. We've got this sweatshirt, which is like my hospital sweatshirt. I've got the Kentucky sweatshirt. Should I take that one or no? I mean, yeah, we'll take it. A Nike sweatshirt, my nurse sweatshirt. I probably don't need my 1998 sweatshirt. And honestly, yeah, we're going to keep the Nike one. Okay, so those can go there. We're going to stick these over here on the side. Shove those in. Um, something about packing just irritates the fire out of me. This jacket can go over here as well. All right, guys, it is one day away from me going to North Carolina. I just actually got off the phone with my recruiter and he gave me my first day instructions, which I didn't get when I went to Louisiana because the hospital like dropped the ball. I didn't know where I was supposed to go, what I was supposed to do, but I'm gonna meet with HR at eight to 8.30 to get my badge and get all those paperwork figured out. And then I'm supposed to be at the hospital at nine o'clock in the morning. There are two different places um, and to do like Epic training, um, EMR training, Pixis training, uh, Epic, I already said Epic training, um, paperwork, little modules, that kind of thing. So more of a computer day. And then hopefully I will start like the next couple days on the floor doing orientation. Um, but here's the funny thing. I'm supposed to wear navy blue scrubs, okay? I have a bunch of pewter. You guys can see over here I have so much pewter. But literally... I went to our scrub place here in town and I ordered them two weeks ago. Still not in. They said they're not going to ship until the end of February. Um, so I have one pair of navy figs that I'm going to use for the first day. And then after that, I'm probably this weekend once I get there and settled in and stuff on Sunday, I'm going to see if the scrub store is open and go get a pair of scrubs. I'm not quite sure how that's going to work. But we'll play it by ear. I still have so much to pack. Um, here is a little bit of... What I have so far, um, I am so excited. I still have so much to pack though. I've gotta get my computer, I've gotta got get my bathroom stuff. Um, I forgot about taxes, so I'm gonna have to take all the tax papers with me so I can get that done, which I might try to get done ahead of time. Um, oh, he just sent me my instructions, that's exciting. Um, I guess I didn't have to write this stuff down. Anyway, so pumped, I'm really excited, so I'll probably, um, see you guys tomorrow morning uh, when I wake up. I just wanted to give you guys a little update on what's going on. Um, I'm so excited and I cannot wait for this chapter and I'm probably, my goal is to like get one video a month or no, one video a week up and running. Um, I think that's probably the most accurate way to do it if I want to like stay up to date with you guys. So I will see you guys tomorrow and I'm so excited and I will see you soon.
I'm so excited. I am up and I'm gonna go to the grocery with my dad and then we are gonna pack my car, do all the things. Um, look at my cute little shirt. It says travel more, worry less, don't mind the messy mirror. Um, but I'm super excited and it's gonna be fun. Oh, I can't wait to take you guys along for the ride. Gas stations. All right guys, we're making my last breakfast Sammy at home. She said, she said it's awesome. Got my egg, my turkey bacon, pepper jack cheese. I've tried this yesterday and it's actually pretty good. I put a little bit of my peanut butter, chocolate chip, I mean, it looks yogurt, like a gas station inside, and then mom made biscuits. Forever. So I'm gonna do my breakfast Sammy on a biscuit today and see how it tastes. <laughs> oh, you want to be nice to me after? Yeah, sure. Oh. And we're off. We are on our way to get gas first off because mm -hmm. I, hold on, Paige is calling me. Alright, we're in the gas station. It's 40 degrees out and I'm wearing shorts. We love that for me. Um, let's get energy drinks. I'm probably going to buy Sprite. And I'm also going to get a Slurpee. Um, I hope they have my drinks here. Aha! This is the best one. I have had Banks. Dalton used to drink them, but I don't like them. Nah. -uh. All right. That's what we're getting. What about the Celsius? I've heard good things about Celsius. I didn't get her. <laughs> I like went. Oh. <laughs> Do I have Celsius? Okay. Should we try the Celsius? We'll try one. Okay. Why did you get it? A bigger size. And do I need all of that? Did you need all of that? <laughs> no, I guess not. Okay, you go first. Oh, it's right. Oh. I'm gonna put a little bit of dark pepper on top. I'm not gonna fill it all the way up. It's like it's too much. Mm -hmm. This is how you do it. This is how you make a legit slurpee. I know, but I don't. I don't want to fill it to the to the brim. That's how you what do it, my dear. Do a little cherry on top. All right, y'all. And our 58 other drinks. And I still have to get some candy because I want some Airhead bites. <laughs> don't let her tell y'all that she's healthy. I'm trying to be healthy, but I want to get some snacky snacks for my five hour trip, okay? It's five hours. That's like the time between breakfast and lunch. Or lunch and dinner. Okay, it's our first stop. Um, we are in, honestly, I don't even know where I'm at to be, to be for real, for real. Um, I know I just got in Tennessee like 30 minutes ago, but I need to stop and pee. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get gas. 
This gas station looks a little sketchy. But there's a Dunkin', so I'm gonna get um, some coffee and hopefully it doesn't make me have to stop in a couple of minutes to go to the bathroom, if you know what I mean. Um, but we're gonna get gas. We're gonna let my phone charge for a minute. I might say hi to my people on TikTok while I'm stopped, um, but I know for sure I'm getting Dunkin'. So I need to go and do those things before I pee my pants. All right, so I hate that this is in the way, but first of all, anyway. Um, <clears throat> all right, so we got a coffee from Dunkin'. I don't normally drink Dunkin'. Normally we have Starbucks, but that's actually delicious. 10 out of 10, it is called a medium iced original cocoa mocha signature latte. Probably 900 carbs and calories in here, but I really don't even care. Let's go. All right, guys, we're here. Walking in. Dun, da, da, dun. You guys, I'm literally so pumped right now. Let me set my keys down. So they have dimmers on all the, all the lights. Let's turn this on. Look how stinking cute. I am obsessed. My little living room, my bedroom, my bathroom, oh my lanta. All right, let's start bringing stuff in and packing or putting it away. I'm probably gonna set you guys up like over here, so we'll see. Oh my gosh, it is so stinking cute in here. It looks like this right now, but I promise it will look so much better here in about 45 minutes when I get it all done. Um, I'm like out of breath from that. That was that was stressful. I seriously like did not think that it was gonna be that tiring. But for now, I'm going to put some stuff in the fridge and go from there. They have like super cute dishes and stuff up here for me. The sink is so cute. Like literally everything is perfect.
most of this stuff from when I was in Louisiana um, because I had to buy like dishes or like some type of bowls. Not really bowls, but like I had to buy some stuff. I wouldn't say a lot of stuff, but I did pretty good. Let's get my scale out. Hopefully I got batteries for this. If I don't, gotta go buy some. Doesn't really fit the aesthetic in here because it's more silver. Ooh, it already has battery. Perfect. We're gonna set that right there. Before I dive out into the mystery, travel the world. There's no other girl. I can. The only thing is, like, where the heck am I supposed to put this now? I don't know where the where am I supposed to put this? In my trunk, I guess? What is this? A napkin holder? All right, time to find, here's the deal. Like, where am I supposed to put my food? Not very many options, you know? And I may end up like changing this. I don't know where I'm gonna put all this stuff. I don't need this many plates. Actually, some of this, I'm just gonna leave two. down here because there's extra down here and I'm not going to use them all. figure out another place to put all this stuff but for right now this is what we're working with I don't really hate it hold on I don't really hate it but I don't necessarily love it either but I mean for right now that's what's gonna have to happen until I find another place for it Okay, so here's the thing. There's not a lot of space. This is the only storage space that I have. Um, and then this desk that I'm gonna put my, obviously like office stuff in. I may use the bottom as, I don't know, I gotta see what's down here actually. I may actually store clothes down here to be honest. I mean, there's office stuff. It's like an office desk, but I don't see why I couldn't store clothes down here. Cause look, 
It's got openings or sections so I could put different things in there. We might, we might do that because I don't have a lot of storage space over here. So we'll see how that goes. of space here for like that stuff but I've got workout tops which all of that stuff is I guess gonna have to go in the desk because I don't have space for it anywhere else um, I've got a little shoe space down there I'm probably gonna put sweatpants down there shoe space up there and then I guess all my workout tops are just gonna have to go under my desk and I'm gonna have to make it work uh, because I don't have any other place for it and I don't know what I'm gonna do with my suitcases when I'm done because there's no other spot for me to put them unless I just put them in my trunk. Which I mean, I can put them in my trunk, it's just annoying. But we'll see. Which I guess I could stack them in here. There's another one. hoping it fits under the bed. If it doesn't, I also don't know where I'm gonna put my scrubs, so I've gotta save a spot for those too. Oh, we'll make it work, right? Here we go. All right, so there's not much bathroom storage, so we're gonna have to work with this the best we, way we can. So here is my phone stand that I brought. Obviously, it's the one that I use in the bathroom. Um, these are the essentials that I use daily. I knew I brought this bin for some reason. I just didn't know what. So I'm glad it works there for my dailies. And then under here, I just have, because this is the only storage I have. So I've got all my like extra bathroom stuff in here. And then I've got my skincare, my makeup, and then all of my like everyday skincare products in there. And then over here, got my bathroom stuff or my shower stuff there. And then my two loofahs hang there perfectly. He's like, you can put your shampoo and conditioner in there. And I was like, no, I'll just keep them in mind. Got my towels, I've got in here the washer and dryer. So there's that, perfect. And then over here, I'll just finish up and show you guys. I already showed you this a little bit earlier, but we've got, whoops, we've got all my hung up clothes here, other stuff here, and then we did use the underneath here part for the rest of my storage. So hopefully that'll work. If not, I'll have to get something else. I'm thinking about getting like a three tiered, hold on, let me turn this around. I'm thinking about getting like a three-tiered pull drawer thing that I can put like scrubs, socks, underwear, bra, workout clothes, pajamas in, stuff like that. Something small from Target or something, Walmart maybe. Um, but other than that, I've got my rest of my desk stuff set up. I've got my computer. This opens. And so I'm going to use this as obviously like my desk and then my jewelry. Um, it plugs in there, so that's pretty cool. I'm, in, I'm like really excited about that. And then I can plug my ring light in to that if I'm doing any videos or anything right there. Um, Alexa, stop. Probably gonna have to keep this stuff in my car. Um, it's like my suitcases and extra bins and stuff like that, but we're gonna have to keep that in my car. And then look how cute this is. I set this up today, or just now. Um, I got my little books here and then my, um, I'm gonna get a candle to put there. And then my Bible and my devotional. I'm gonna hang this blanket up over there. I've got my guitar in the corner. The kitchen is pretty much set up the way I'm probably going to keep it. Um, it just looks cute and studio-like to me, so that's probably what I'll do. Over here, I've got all of my, like, Q products that I'll grab and go. It's kind of, like, just convenient right there. My food scale for counting my macros. Don't mind my spray tan hand. Um, and then my fridge got some stuff in it. Not much. i got to go grocery shopping. Anyway, um, I think I'm going to end the vlog here. I have 
so much left to do but i'm just going to end it here and we will start fresh on monday i am going to kind of take you guys through my entire like process of how i started a new hospital that kind of thing so that will be like its own like first day first day of assignment um vlog so i'll do that um i'll take you guys grocery shopping all that good stuff um kind of get the things that i need obviously i need to start meal prep tomorrow maybe i'll do that as a vlog maybe i'll do that as a TikTok. i don't know yet how i'm going to make this work but my plan is to get one vlog up a week um, depending on my work schedule, I work 11 to 11, so it kind of depends on what my hours look like, what days I work, and when I'll have time to edit. So, other than that, this is my humble home, and I'll see you guys next time.